Hi, welcome to the University of York's postgraduate virtual tour. I'm Haruna and my pronouns are they, them, and today I'll be showing you some of the facilities that York has to offer for its postgraduate students. We start our tour here on Campus West. At the moment, I'm outside Greg's place with Central Hall behind me. Central Hall, as its name suggests, is at the heart of Campus West. It's a great place to meet friends, course mates, or enjoy a book by the lake. People also call it the Spaceship Building, and it hosts exams, public events, and graduations. Here at York, postgraduate students usually graduate in January. Barrack Saul, which is the Arts and Humanities Research Center, is the first of many postgraduate study spaces that we'll be visiting today. It's for Arts and Humanities students and has social and study spaces. The foyer of Barracks Saul is a social space and a great area to chat about ideas with your seminar group and get to know each other. There is also a Cake Thursday, which is a great tradition during term time, bringing students and staff together. In the past, I've used this space to host events with other postgraduate students and hold a reception afterwards. Barracks Saul has two floors of postgraduate study spaces, with big windows that look over the trees and greenery, and PhD students can also apply for their own study desks. Having a study space like this is ideal for a change of scenery from your home or department. It also makes it easy to collaborate with others or just focus on your work. This leads us on nicely to the library, which is about a five minute walk from Barracksall. Here you can access thousands of digital and physical resources and books. The library is open 24 hours, 362 days a year, and is divided into three sections. One of them is Fairhurst, where you can go to chat and collaborate on work. Fairhurst is also home to the Math Skills Center and Writing Center. These centers are worth taking advantage of during your master's degree, particularly if you'll be working with research data or if you would like help with your academic writing. The Math Skills Center provides great tips on how to work with and present data for coursework and dissertations. The Writing Center is also handy during your dissertation period, especially if you want someone to review your use of English, not just the content of your essay. There is also a dedicated postgraduate study lounge on the same floor, which requires a postgraduate keycard to gain access to. This means that no matter how busy the library gets, postgraduate students always have a quiet, dedicated space. The other two sections of the library are called Morel and Burton. These are quieter study spaces and home to over one million books. The Borthwick Archives behind me is another section of the library that is particularly noteworthy for postgraduate students. Here you can access many historical documents that give your work the edge. There is also another University of York library in York City Centre called King's Manor. This historic building is quite the attraction and offers a quiet alternative study space away from the hustle and bustle of campus. After a busy day at the library, there's nothing better than to catch up with friends over a drink. Luckily, there's a variety of cafes and bars across campus. Right now, I'm at the kitchen, which is a nice quiet cafe. We've now arrived at Market Square. Here, there's a convenient Nisa supermarket where you can get a pint of milk or something to eat. There's also a merchandise shop, print solutions where you can get your dissertation bound, and the student hub, which can be very helpful. This is The Quiet Place, one of our lovely green spaces on campus. It's a great place to come and relax and is also where most students take their dissertation and graduation photos. We're now outside of Visu, the Students' Union, which represents all students at York. Yusu offers independent advice, runs some venues on campus, facilitates department, course, and academic representatives, and they organize sports teams. We have over 200 societies on campus, from baking sock to artificial intelligence. Something for everyone. If there's something else you can think of, though, it's really easy to set up your own. Wentworth Graduate College is another space dedicated solely to postgraduate students. It has over 5,000 members, some of whom live on campus and others live off campus. This college offers events, talks and presentations, community activities, and opportunities to learn additional skills and support. 
When I was applying for my postgraduate degree, I was really concerned about whether I would be able to fit in and meet people, especially with the courses being only a year long. However, the Wentworth Graduate College really instills a sense of community and is a great safe space to socialize. Welcome to Campus East, a short 15 minute walk away from Campus West. I'm Laura and my pronouns are she, her. I was an undergraduate student in BA management and enjoyed it so much that I decided to study my master's degree in global marketing at the York Management School. A really important thing to me during my postgraduate degree is that I have a good work-life balance. So I signed up to the sports village behind me where students get discounted membership fees. The facilities available include a swimming pool, velodrome and football pitches. There is also a gym and lots of classes every day which you can get involved in. I really recommend the cycling classes. Here on Campus East there is another Nisa, Greg's, Doctor's Surgery, Takeaway, Restaurants and a Hairdresser's. As a postgraduate student, I found these really useful as you have everything on your doorstep rather than having to worry about where to go for your shopping, takeaway or haircut. We are now at the Roncook Hub. This is central to Campus East and is a great place for postgraduate students as it has lots of study spaces and a cafe which is great to meet up with your seminar group or catch up with your supervisor. Behind me are the lakeside pods, which all students can book out. These are a great space for postgraduates to write their dissertations and do their coursework, as they are peaceful and isolated away from the hustle and bustle of campus. The Roncook Hub has large lecture halls and meeting spaces. The island of interaction at the top of the hub is a great cosy space for work too. It feels really informal with bean bags and comfy seats so you can relax between lectures. We are now at the Piazza building which is next door to the Ronco Hub. This also has lecture theatres, seminar rooms and isolated study spaces for groups and studying alone. There is also a restaurant and cafe. Thanks for joining us. If you'd like to know more about campus or postgraduate life, you can check out our website. We hope to welcome you at York soon.